Michael Collins was one of the most famous Irish men of all time, and on the day of his funeral, 500,000 people turned up in Dublin city to attend. Michael was ambushed by the anti-treaty IRA in Bail na in Cork during the Irish Civil War. The Anglo-Irish Treaty has been debated for over a hundred years now, with strong opinions on both sides. Me, I sit right in the middle. I think that the plenipotentiary's mitigation of further loss of Irish life by Crown forces was the smartest option. However, and that's a big however, I look up to the anti-treaty IRA as much as any other figure in Irish history. After fighting the most brutal two and a half year guerrilla war that Ireland has ever seen, after marching miles each day through the harsh Irish winters, after going days without food, after sleeping in cattle sheds using old newspaper as a blanket, after battling black and tans, Ogsies, British army in the wild rural roads of Ireland, the anti-treaty IRA never accepted anything less than what was deserved. The Irish Civil War was a war with no winners or losers, and was one of the worst times in Irish history when friends and families split.